you think these are weasel words? Do you suspect that the Queen might have COVID? I always suspect anything that the palace <laughs> says, to be honest. Uh, have done have done for years. But, I mean, at the moment, as you quite rightly said, Isabel, they're saying that she's not displaying any symptoms and they're refusing to say if she's uh, taken a test, never mind if she's positive, ne- negative or uh, positive. So, at the moment, we have to accept that, uh, thank- thankfully, she is fine. OK. And the concern, of course, is that Prince Charles, who tested positive on Thursday last week, had had afternoon tea with Her Majesty on the, a week ago today, so last Tuesday. And there was some concern that he might have been emanating the, uh, the virus before he knew he was positive. Well, I'm, I'm, sh- I'm, sh- I'm sure that uh, the royal doctors, uh, in knowing this, would have taken the appropriate steps uh, with the Queen. I mean, I, I doubt very much anybody's going to start taking any risks with Her Majesty at all at this great age that she is at 95, and given that she's just celebrated the Platinum Jubilee, um, uh, we just got to keep our fingers crossed that she, in fact, is OK, because obviously, again, she's, a, she's an, in the vulnerable age group. And so is Camilla, uh, it has to yes. be said. And uh, we, we end yeah. up, it was, it's her that we know has it, and everybody's talking about the Queen. <laughs> what about poor Camilla? Uh, poor old Camilla uh, has got it, and, and this is one of the reasons why we know that she, she's got it, and Prince Charles, is because she's been carrying out on the same day a, a string of engagements, and all the people that she came into contact with, including the travelling entourage and the uh, and the press and everything else who were, who were there, had to be notified and told uh, so that they too can be uh, taking appropriate steps. So, yeah, uh, let's hope that uh, if, if she, is, she has got COVID because they've announced that and that it's uh, a mild form as with Prince Charles. But poor old Prince Charles, this is the second time he's caught it. He caught it last March as well. So, uh, you know, he's he's been going through the wars too. And if-